Today, Uganda joined the rest of the world to commemorate World AIDS Day, a day meant to pay tribute to millions of people living with the virus and those who have succumbed to it. Here in Uganda, the celebrations were held in Rukunjiri district and they attracted a number of dignitaries from the central government, local governments and other agencies. President Yoru Museveni was the guest of honor. While giving his speech, Museveni echoed the call for everyone to keep safe and prevent falling victim to HIV. Ugandans have been reminded that the virus is still here and can kill. Rukunjiri district is one of the districts with the highest HIV and AIDS prevalence rates. It is ranked 14 on the national scope. In case you get infected, go for treatment so that you, you don't die and you, you live long. But remember, you will not be fully, you will not fully meet your potential. This is medical because I, I, I have been checking and we had seen it in the army. Some of our people who were on these drugs, when they went into physical exercise, they, they, they collapsed. And thirdly, if you are on these drugs, please stick to them so that you don't, re you don't relapse. Thank you very much. Defense Minister Major General Jim Mohwezi and Minister for the Presidency Mili Babalanda praised the President for efforts geared towards fighting HIV and AIDS. He's dangerous, has no cure, but he's avoidable. And you brusquely explained that we know where the snake is in that hole, and if you put your finger in that hole, you'll get the problem, and the people recognized it and, and avoided it. So we thank you very much. And you have done the same in the other pandemics like, like COVID-19, Ebola. You have been in the forefront in teaching. When you are addressing people, you don't read the statements. No, you teach, you explain, and the people understand. We thank you. In 2017, you launched the Presidential Fast Track Initiative to end AIDS as a public health threat in Uganda by 2030. You directed the Uganda AIDS Commission to coordinate the implementation of the Presidential Initiative to end AIDS by 2030. Your Excellency, I am pleased to note that five years later, a lot of progress has been achieved, as you have heard from the previous speakers. I take this opportunity to thank the First Lady and Mama, Honorable Janet Kataham Seven, for her invaluable contribution, particularly in the efforts towards eliminating mother-child transmission of HIV. Download the app on App Store or Google Play Store now. Vision Digital Experience, the future of media.